everyone, it's Crystal, and I have a um, haul video for you. Uh, I was supposed to record this about <laughs> a week ago, and I'm just getting around to it now. So I wanted to get this haul recorded and everything so I can get this stuff put away, and I'm going to start using some of it. So, Alright, so I'm just going to start off the dollar store. Um, so I picked up some scotch tape, and I needed this for wrapping Christmas gifts. And for a dollar, you can't beat that. I also picked up some tissue paper. This is where I always buy my tissue paper, especially my white tissue paper. Because you get 40 sheets of it for a dollar. And that is a really good deal. So, I grabbed that. Let me just throw this in this bag real quick. And this. And then I also picked up these cute, cute gift bags. I just needed one of them, but they came in a two-pack for a dollar. And it's like the old vintage style, like Santa Claus. So you got this one and that one. And they even come with little gift tags already on them. So and for a dollar, you know, you can't beat that. So that was pretty much all. Well, I picked up some other things from the dollar store. Um, they were like picks and that to use for my mesh wreath, um, which I have already done completed the mesh wreath. If you follow me on Instagram, you've already seen the picture of it. Um, if you don't follow me on Instagram, um, you can go ahead. Um, the links, I think, are down below for my Instagram and all that. I might be doing a quick YouTube video, probably like 30 seconds, just, just to show you guys what it turned, turned out like. Um, it's actually really cute. So I went to Hobby Lobby, actually it'll be a week ago tomorrow, and like all their holiday gifting supplies and that were 50% off. So I picked up one of these paper cutters from Fiskars. Um, I have, I think Scotch might make the other one, and I love it, but I don't know where it's at, and I really don't feel like looking for it. So this was $4, and 50% off made it $2. Couldn't beat that. Um, I picked up some curly ribbon. And you got this, um, all this ribbon here for $3 and 50% off makes a dollar fifty. I also picked up these really, really cute gift tags. Um, they're, they're a 12 count and they are $2, so it made them a dollar. So it was really cute. And, um, yeah, I was going to make my own tags this year, but just decided not to. And then I also picked up some more tissue paper from there. Um, it's, this is just a 12 count. And it's more decorative. You know, it was $2, so made it a dollar. And I also picked up all the stuff for my mesh wreath from Hobby Lobby. And so I can't show you guys it because the wreath is already done. But, yeah. Oh, and I also got this from Hobby Lobby. This is some sequence. Um, this was $1.47, and then it was 50% off, so. And there you go. Okay, I went to a store called Packetans. Um, I really, really like going into there, because I always find some really good deals. This is, um, those sort of like Pandora style bracelets and this kit was on sale for seven dollars and it originally goes for ten so I grabbed that and then I also picked up this all over the page punch from Martha Stewart and I believe I've seen crafting Kate with this punch and she makes her own um, confetti with it so all it is is just the star one and it's just, you know, you can just do it wherever on the page. And this was 50% off. So I think this was like 15 bucks maybe. And then 50% off made like $7.50. Something like that. So that was an awesome deal. And um, I just, I've been wanting one of those punches for a while. And I finally decided to go ahead and pick it up. Okay. Hold on here one second. 
right, then I went to Joann's and I got this die here. This is a movers and shapers die. And this was $6.97 on clearance. And I don't have it. And I've been wanting this one. And also that real big um, tag he has. I've been wanting that one as well too. I just haven't picked it up lately. Or haven't picked it up at all. So that wasn't bad for $7. And then I also picked up a new um, corner rounder, a corner chomper. Um, the one I have, which I think I might actually threw it in the garbage. I don't know. But the one I have wasn't working right, and it got because I left it on one of my window sills, and uh, anyways, it rusted out a little bit. But it was completely my fault because where I was storing it at. So this was on sale for forty percent off. So. Grabbed another one of those. And then the last thing I picked up from Joann's was these glass paints by Martha Stewart. And these are the metallic ones. I picked up uh, pure platinum, copper, and yellow gold. And these were on clearance for $1.97. But I know a lot of people make their own enamel dots from like a, the uh, that Viva Decor squeeze pens. You know, it's like a glass paint, too. So, I really don't know how well the lighting's going to pick up on those. But that's why I picked those up, to see what they, if they would work. <laughs> Hopefully they do. If not, I'll find something else. But $1.97 wasn't bad. And then the last of the haul is from Michael's. And when I went to Michael's, it was last Friday... And they had a really good deal going on um, on their paper pads. Their holiday Christmas paper pads were hmm, I think they were like 70% off or something like that. Anyways, this one retails for $20 and I got it for $5.97. And then on top of that I had another coupon for 25% off. Your entire purchase and it included regular and sell price items so it even made this cheaper yet so i picked this up this is the lost and found christmas from my mind's eye and i'm sure you guys have all seen this but i'll just flip through it pretty quickly here just so you can get a look at it so yeah this was i don't know like 550 i think i paid for it after everything Anyways, it was really, really cheap, and I couldn't pass it up, and I didn't pick up any kind of Christmas paper this year. And I was really proud of myself because I didn't, but, um, yeah, so I figured I would try using this for my layouts this year. We'll see how it works out. Because I canceled all my memberships and everything, and... Yeah, so I needed some Christmas paper, and that was an awesome deal. Now, I also picked up this paper as well, and again, this was, I think, $5.50 after all said and done. And this is the Die Cuts with a View Holiday Glitz Glitter Stack. And guys, this glitter, uh, I mean, it doesn't come off, but it is so onto the paper. Like, it doesn't even feel like glitter. I don't know how else to explain it. It's just really, really nice. So I picked up this stack, and I figured, you know, this doesn't have to go just for Christmas either, and that's the nice part about it. So, and again, it was, um, I think, like I said, five fifty. I think I might have paid for it afterwards, everything. So I couldn't pass that up. So those were the two paper pads I picked up. Um, I also picked up these mirrored sheets from Tim Holtz, and these were on clearance for... Um, let's see, you can see my mess. <laughs> uh, these were on clearance for I think two thirty nine or something like that. Um, I picked up this Lost and Found my, my my Mind's Eye chipboard stickers, and it goes with the paper pad. I also picked up the decorative buttons for that collection as well, and then two package of enamel dots. For my mind's eye. I 
And then here's the other one. And then the last thing I picked up were, were these two stamp sets. And I think these were like $5. And then after everything, after being on sale and the extra discount I got off, it was like two something. I think this might be my receipt right here. Oh, I'm sorry. The paper pads, the 12 by 12 paper pads, were I ended up paying $4.52. For each paper pad. So, I had a really, really, really good deal. And these stamps were, after everything, was $2.24. So, um, couldn't pass that up. There's what the stamps look like. So that is my haul guys, um, yeah, I was supposed to put a video up like two weeks ago and I just uploaded it here tonight, so sorry about that, <clears throat> um, that video pretty much explains what's been going on with me, I've just been completely out of it, so, um, yeah, so guys, um, I'm hoping to have at least one more video before Christmas, so. I should talk to you before then. But until next time, guys, I'll talk to you later. Have a great day. Bye.